And now to the latest case of suspected road rage here in central Indiana. A Texas man right now is jailed here in Indianapolis tonight. He's accused of shooting another driver along the interstate. The victim is now in the hospital after getting shot Sunday night on the ramp from 465 to I-70. This is near Shadeland. On Monday, police arrested the suspect at a hotel in Franklin. Jenny Runovich actually found out why investigators believe it is a case of road rage. Photos from state police show bullet holes in the truck police say was targeted by another driver on I-70. Plus, shell casings found on the highway. Five shots fired, according to court documents. The man inside the truck drove himself to the hospital Sunday night after a bullet hit him in the back. A passenger in the suspect's car told detectives the truck tried to ram them, that his driver then got mad, chased the truck, pulled a gun, and opened fire. The victim claims the other driver wanted a race, and that's why shots were fired when he wouldn't. Either way, police believe road rage was a factor. Detectives used flop cameras to track down the suspect's car and make the arrest for attempted murder. It's dangerous when you engage in road rage, and we see time and time again that these road rage incidents are leading to violence and gunfire. And so uh, we're discouraging anybody from engaging in any type of road rage. This is the fourth shooting on an Indianapolis interstate just this year, and we're barely into February. Jenny Runovich, 13 News. State police say there were 56 highway shootings in Indianapolis last year, plus 236 cases where someone displayed or pointed a gun because of road rage.